It's spring break, baby. I think this is the first year since like genuinely like 2016 of actually going somewhere for spring break. Long awaited, so glad to be off school. But I gotta head in the shower, finish packing, and then off to the airport. Hey fam, update. It is frigid in the airport, so this is the current setup. Me and Dick are waiting for our $18 chicken nuggets. <laughs> our flight has been delayed till 10, so now we have to sleep in Charlotte and then head up to Boston tomorrow. I saw my best friend Kennedy. Kennedy, if you're watching, hey girl, I'll be at your college next weekend. Catch me there. Anyways, much love. We boarding, hey, about to enter. Only like five hours freaking later, 11 o'clock. Catch us in Charlotte overnight. Let's freaking go. We're on the plane. I got my window seat, period. Hey guys, update. Made it in Charlotte. Currently on the floor of the airport. It's like 1 of 8 a.m. Um, we have to find a hotel to stay at. The catch is our flight's at like 7. So really by the time we get a hotel, we might as well just stay here. So I'm thinking this is going to be my hotel for the night. So uh, my ears didn't pop on the plane though. Kitching, let's freaking go. My mom was talking to freaking like three year olds about Taylor Swift, like no one cares. Get friends your own age, wow. But I mean, I guess that was nice, but I'm like, babe, it's 12 in the morning, like, no, like, please don't talk about this. I'll be on the floor if any of you need me. Hey y'all, we're doing 24 hours in the airport challenge. We in Charlotte, North Carolina right now, and we staying here till our flight tomorrow, yeah. Look at this airplane. Um, I don't know what this is. Oh man, for so this airport is actually humongous. So this is where we're gonna be sleeping. One thirty-three. This is my car. Take her to pound town. Take her to pound town. I roll like a roll like a roll. What if I sleep on this? Wait, wait. This is the first level of my home. Let's head up to the second level. Fun fact about me. I'm actually scared of escalators. This is really scary. Why is it going so fast? I swear it's over this fast. Woo! Is it even going to be exciting up here? Like, probably not. But I mean, it's exciting wherever I am. Sorry. <gasps> is this? Oh my gosh. Is this the airport? Oh my gosh. Look at all the planes. Who are you? Sorry. It's like getting to that hour. It's like 1.30. Like, I'm not awake ever here. Here's another, whoa, I cannot stand on that. I'm gonna fall through. Biggie thought she had a skinny moment. That's embarrassing. Skincare in the airport check. skincare on fleek wow why am i red okay i didn't even make it in the i'm not picking that up i'm sorry call me a litter bug call me a earth killer i'm sorry i'm not picking up my q-tip like i'm sorry i'm not sorry if i was sorry i would have picked it up anyways i'm heading to bed bye hey guys i'm on the charlotte flight i can't even see through it by myself starting off boston right boston tea party where you at this is not a Teacup. Sorry, that just like struck me the realization. Hey, y'all, we in Boston, baby! I thought you were gonna join in. Anyways, we're getting ready for the day. Today, we're just going to lacrosse games and we're scouting out Harvard because I'm actually like, I'm already applied with D0 scholarships because you know how like there's D1, well, D0 is like way better and I'm D0. Pranked you. Literally just put our stuff down in the hotel. See you on the road to the little cross game. <laughs> hey, ghostly girl. I know, that didn't work out very well, did it? Don't recommend. Okay, well, this just doesn't even look good. Like, Michaela had it on TikTok and it was half price. So I Make your bag. Kim Kardashian. Isn't she from here? We gotta find her. Okay. Anyways, here's my outfit. It's giving Harvard, it's giving Boston College. 
It's all Lululemon, which means I have to go to the Lululemon store right across the street, right? Yeah, Trader Joe's is next door too. Hey! Anyways, see you about town. <laughs> My toxic trait is really thinking that my JV self could walk on this field and defend these D1 college lacrosse players. Oh. College goal scored by number 38, Kayla Martello. I thought number three was McKenna. That's a ground ball. I would get that because I'm just her. And that's actually me with the, uh... Oh wait, that literally is me. That's 18. I'm freaking 18. That's actually me. That's actually me running away in the pink. Hi, Nadia. That's Nadia. Hi. Hey. Can we look it up? I want to know who's my number. Hold on. Uh, I don't know if you can see that, but it says Ryan Smith. <laughs> She's a sophomore too? So am I. Oh my gosh. It's meant to be Ryan Smith. If you're watching this, I heart you. You're doing great, sweetie. Look at you run. Look at you run. the field now like i don't know how we got here but we're getting autographs from everyone so this is after the autographs and i'm saying i have beef with ryan smith because she's the one girl i wanted to find because we share numbers and where was she at i heard that she left to see her family my fam her family is me we're gonna be family when we are on that turf playing lacrosse together so uh i'm letting her know we have beef and the only way she can make it up if is she comments on this video i love nadia logue so sorry i missed you and then i said much love um then this is me showing you the campus it was so stunning so pretty i literally loved it like oh uh, i felt like i was in a little like oh uh, a little fun town like it low-key gave london vibes um, I don't really know what I'm going on about here, but I did at one point say I was like a city and a uh, college campus connoisseur, and this one I liked a lot. The outside little city part, it was kind of giving like, it didn't match the vibes of Boston College, like it was kind of odd, there wasn't much around it, but it's literally like a subway ride away from literally everything everywhere so it's literally fine uh, this is me saying imagine me frolicking through the campus um that's me frolicking uh this is me saying i don't know if you can oh now we're at harvard i said why is there a coliseum behind me that's the coliseum in question but i felt like we were in rome but anyways now we're at a harvard dartmouth um lacrosse game this is them playing it was a much different vibe then Boston College, we only stayed till halftime. Harvard, I want to say one because they were winning. But yeah, it was fun to see like the different, um, like what schools play. Because I, I didn't realize Harvard and Dartmouth were still D1. So hi. Then all the Dartmouth people had fun Easter hats. Um, I don't know what that was for, but I said I want a hat. And then I feel out of place because I'm wearing maroon and there's green everywhere. We at the cool. Catch us at the cool. Catch me with all the Harvard merch. Why is this a mall? Like, why do I actually live here? See, that's just so boring. It's a basic. I would buy that if I went to Harvard. Like, that's what the Harvard people get to fit in. It's because it reminds me of Harry Potter. Also, I have to film on my phone now because tell me why my camera is doing the slow motion thing again. Babe, she's brand new. I don't know why she's acting up, but... Me and Harvard. You're getting this iPhone quality until... Who knows when. Daddy's feast of the day. We're at Joe's Pizza. I got pepperoni. And then... Sicilian. And for punch. There's all these celebrities on the wall. 
wonder if I'll be one of them one day. Anyway, cheers. That's good. Oh, that piece is good. Oh my gosh, that's a Kim K. Oh my gosh, that's a Chloe K. Hold on. Kim K. Chloe K. Only in the subway would a ginger man be playing the drums to Hispanic music. But we're going to our hotel because why haven't we slept two hours today? Because we've been traveling since 6 p.m. last okay, night. Okay, it wasn't a question you answered. Oh, sorry. Here's the view we're looking at the bridge. Look, that's the tea party. Um, Boston tea party. Boston tea party. Museum. Where you throw the tea Hello. The boat. What if I throw my fruit punch into the boat? Does that like start the same side of like start? Wait. Would that start the same type of revolution? Oh, what party were we not invited to? That's embarrassing. Anyways, catch us on the streets of Boston. Just hey there. Right so, plot twist. We made a pit stop at church. My husband, wow. That's the love of my life. Why am I all hot? That's embarrassing. We were just with the Lord, our Savior. It was actually really pretty. And the girl had a nice voice. But now we're heading back to our hotel. Bye. About to go recreate that Boston Tea Party. Screw the British. Wait, I'm doing a British accent. That doesn't add up. Why is tickets for the Boston Tea Party $80? No wonder the Boston hated British Parliament. Because what is this? So we need to have another revolt. Because $80 is not okay. This is forced upon us by Parliament. Supposedly on behalf of our monarch, King George III. Yay! The vessels, the Eleanor. Dartmouth and the Brig Beaver, and their holds are first. Stop that yoke of parliamentary tyranny, say aye. aye! Aye! And if you are here to be captured and arrested for treason, say aye! Aye! Oh my gosh, no, no, no. <laughs> that was a bit tricky. We downstairs, we outside. This house is very nice. I would live on this ship. I would be a, a loyal Boston tea thrower. House tour. Hey. Hey friend. Time to get up, buddy. Look and come. Is that my husband? Hi, hey. He's writing me a love story. Buddy? It's okay. I actually have a name. I'm Samuel Cooper. And I'm 16 and I'm 60 miles around. That red brick building with the green window that's right across. Why are you bringing the tea back? Orders, I guess we look British now. Nothing but some criminal activities. Nothing but some criminal activities. Get it? Because tea? Yep. Huzzah! 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 That's actually me with my husband. Uh, we're going to buy a boat together and that is going to be on it. Word. Fun fact about me, I love me some pigeons. I need a man to serenade me like that. Hello. Pretend I'm in London and pretend this is the Prime Minister's house and pretend the door is black. Okay, I didn't ask for all that. Thank you. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Come on, climb that rock. Oh goodness, I'm actually gonna pull it out from the ground. Am I pranking you? Because I'm actually not rock climbing. Why is this like scary? Like why am I actually like climbing? <sighs> climbed up a mountain, can you tell? We made it to the river, six minutes till closing. Let's go. These are so adorable. Let's get a new coquette. I just wish, like in this color, I had a cotton short. You know what I mean? Hey guys, gym fit. Ignore the Burks. Why is there Harry Potter in the gym? This is the gym I want to go to every day. Catch me on the Pelotons. Post like five mile bike on the freaking Peloton. Now I'm on the treadmill. I just ran. But. I should not be at the gym right now. Tell me why it's 10.30. I should be showered in bed. And the way that I'm doing all legs 
knowing I'm gonna have to walk miles upon miles these next two days is like absurd. I'm really enjoying the fact Harry Potter's on the TV. Why am I barefoot? Why am I wearing a bralette? Where's the sports bra? Where's the Nike sneakers? Why do I look cute? Wish me luck. Hey guys, we're at Northeastern. I'm official. We're getting a tour. It's actually nice so far. We got off the subway and it's like right there. But I'm hyped. This gets me 10% off the bookstore. I like, kind of forget like this is like the smartest people. This is like the smartest people house. Like this is like the Ryland Ricardos of the world. And they look normal. Like I'm not saying they would look like not normal, but like this is cool. Huh. huh. New York ain't the only place that has subways everywhere. Oh gosh. Oh goodness. Oh oh go oh go oh oh. Hold on. Ah. Made it. I'm actually the Subway Subway's number one fan. There's so many interesting people on it. And it's so fun. <laughs> Red Velvet's the superior cake. That's all I have to say. If you know, you know. Hey guys, last day in Boston. Um, we decided to go to the most touristy place on earth. Um, it was low-key underground for a while, but ever since like its new discovery, you know, it's just really popular. We at the aquarium. I love the aquarium. I love zoos. This is perfect. These remind me of the Bass Pro Shop fish. Therefore, they should stay at Bass Pro Shop um, because it's giving you so. Blackston. Reverend William Blackston moved here. Emerson at the time was out near Boston University and Northeastern University. Look, we're going to come in, we're going to save the theater district. Emerson College being a performing arts school, they were all about the performing arts, saved the theater district. And it has a picture of the Leonard P. Sacum Bunker Hill Memorial Bridge. We're standing right there on the front steps and he apologized for doing this. <laughs> so Ryan and I got a love so Anybody funny. here from Canada on board? Look, the two lanterns in the night of the midnight. Oh, the the boat's going here we go. The water. Hands up in the air like roller coaster. Oh. Ciao, Boston. Hey guys, I'm home from Boston now. I never told you how the Northeastern tour went, so I thought I'd just tell you now. It was actually really fun. The campus was really pretty. Like, there was many things, like, around it. Like, it was really easy to get from point A to point B. And the people seemed really nice. So, I thought that was a lot of fun. Definitely gonna be on my radar. I thought, since I'm home, I would show you everything I got from Boston. So, as I said, there was a Sephora and a Lulu, like, literally across the street from our hotel. So, from Sephora, I got this Tower 28 spray. And then I got this Polish Choice Exfoliate set. I've been using these. I like them. Also, from Sephora, I got this free glow screen with my mom's points. Then, from the Lulu, both of these were on sale, which is really nice. I got these red shorts, because I've been wanting a pair of red pants for a while. And then I got these Align like biker shorts, which I actually wore to the gym. Then the most fun part, everything I got from all the colleges I visited. So from Harvard, I got this H shirt, and then on the back it has all the Ivy Leagues. And then I also got this Harvard crew neck. I just thought it was really cute. I wanted something maroon in retrospect, just because it's like Harvard colors, but I really just... This is, I'm, I'm a blue girl through and through. Then, from Northeastern, which place I toured, I got this with their mascot, King Husky. It was fun hearing about him. That was really fun. Anyways, just a plain shirt says Northeastern. I thought it was really cute. I liked it a lot. Then, you also saw me wear this, but from Boston College, I got this lacrosse shirt. And finally, also from Harvard, from the lacrosse game we went to, I got this Harvard lacrosse shirt. So that's all I got from Boston. Hope you enjoyed the Boston segment of this video. 
Let's head to North Carolina. Good morning. It's 8 a.m. We're heading down to North Carolina. See you at the lacrosse game. <laughs> I've really been trying to get a Virginia Tech goal, so it doesn't look like I'm favoriting UNC. But every time I record Virginia Tech, they miss. I just stopped trying. But it's 9-7 and it's almost the fourth, so. So I'm gonna give you a specialized tour. Over here, you may spend some time studying as it's the library of undergraduates. Currently, we're going to join some student tours. This is kind of cute. <laughs> Kennedy, this is cute. You could sunbathe right there. I'm enjoying this. That's where I would sunbathe. Ooh, pretty. Cute. Okay, Washington Monument. It's giving a cutesy little town. This is like giving what I thought Harvard would be. Let's say. Less, uh, less UNC exciting is than, yeah. UNC is bright. Well, it's also a bright sunny day. But like, the houses look bright. Because they're newer. Harp I know, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's giving dingy. Oh. It's giving run down. This is giving lovely, nice, fun friends. So. We've now entered the famous part of campus. I don't know what this is. A rotunda. What is a rotunda? Okay, just don't tell me. <laughs> it's not on the map, that's why I didn't put it in the GPS. I don't know, but someone's getting a photo with their boyfriend, that makes me sad. Okay, I'm gonna go now, bye. Kennedy, when Louis visits here, make sure to get a photo with him at the Rotunda. Rotunda. Sure, there's a water fountain inside of that. Um, Kennedy, you can refill your water in there. Actually, you might get like banned, I feel like that's like illegal. I should probably like inform myself on the knowledge of that. So. Over here we have a Washington Monument dupe. Uh, so we're making slime. There's an Ublex station all right next to us, but I'm making slime here. And it's chemistry. Ms. Angela would be proud. I'm gonna go home and tell her all about this. We're back at the old well because apparently if you drink from it, it gives you me good luck. Plot twist. I didn't, I didn't drink the water, but we're gonna come back and I'll drink the water then. I feel like it's shamed upon to drink water. Like, I know Abby said, like, do it. Are you setting me up for failure? If I, like, touch that water fountain, is everyone gonna, like, call the cops? I feel like a bunch of, like, secret service agents would, like, come out and be like, you touched the water? Kennedy, I suggest drinking the water for good luck for your first year at this school. Um, it's giving sun kiss from this lacrosse game, but we decided to go to the competitor school. We are at Sleeping Beauty's Castle, AKA Duke. It's giving like elf village. Like look at that house. Tell me that's not an elf house. Tell me Sleeping Beauty wouldn't live there. This is kind of cute and to think I was hanging on it. I just love the little houses. Like they're so cute. Out in the sun. Okay Central Park. Why can you not see it? Okay. That's embarrassing. You can kind of see it. It's giving like fairy village. Quick, take a picture. Look at that walkway. Why is that adorable? It's giving cutesy. It's giving castle. Castle. It's the focal point! Oh my gosh, we're going down the street. Oh, I should have oh, no, just... It's giving a little castle! I love this! It's giving 
palace. Hi, hey Duke. Duke. Okay, cute little man. Hi, taking photos, that's literally me. Oh my gosh, that literally is me. I'm literally taking photos right now. Is that it? Yep. Uncle Point, hey, Maddie. Bye bye, Duke University.